When you tell people you're gay, you have to bear in mind what country you live in. I'm a blogger. Apparently my blog helps some people. I want to use it to explain that being gay is normal and it's nothing bad. It's an individual choice. No faggots allowed anywhere in Russia. Yo, what's up? I'm Kirill Yegor, and today I'm visiting one of German Stelikov stores. There's a sign in the window that says no faggots allowed. Obviously, they don't want me to go in there, but I want to try their milk. Of course, it was a provocation. German's from the countryside, I'm from the countryside, so... So this is what the store looks like. The oil is sold in jars, but I want milk. Of course it was scary. I knew perfectly well that there would be girls working there who just cross themselves when I tell them, I'm gay, I just bought milk from you, and I want to know how things work here. They gave me a discount. I thought they'd start freaking out and would call someone. That's what I was expecting. So I get my milk, go to the checkout, and she says to me, I watch your channel. I watch you on YouTube. Really? Yeah. Hold on. I was expecting at least a bit of outrage from her. Wait, so that means anyone can come in and buy something? Yeah, that's his sign. I can't take it down, but I don't agree with it. If I were allowed to, I would take the sign down right away. That changed everything. It was nice and also unusual. It ended up being a cool video about totally reasonable people working for someone unreasonable. I get that this is a business. Stoligov came up with an image for himself of a simple Russian from the countryside. That's how he earns his money. That's his philosophy. The problem here isn't the laws or the government, but the powerful Russian Orthodox Church. The church thinks being gay isn't normal, and they reduce everything to sex. No one says love whoever you want. Everyone just thinks of the physical side of things. Cheers. The comments under the video were literally hell. People were writing, we're going to kill you, bum boy, freak, die, who the hell are you? You should all hang and you'll burn in hell, that sort of stuff. It's obvious that comments like this don't happen in a vacuum. They wouldn't be there if our society wasn't so homophobic.